the same old, same old, more or less. <laughs> My content's not very good, I guess. I fired up that truck for a little bit. And that one. That one here, I don't know about them trucks. This one here does real good. It sat there for a whole two months and it'll fire right up. This one here, if it sets for a month, it ain't gonna start. Piece of crap. I need to shut my battery off. I'm gonna get me something to shut my ground cable off on my battery. On both these trucks. I might do it on all of them actually. It's kind of a, a theft prediction, uh, a theft thing. Where I'll put my uh, a shut off under the hood somewhere. Because uh, I need to uh, open the hood and check the oil on them anytime in the summertime and I'm using them anyway. So I probably, it's just uh, years of those trucks, they got a lot of computer crap on them. And I don't know. They just drain. It does better when it's hot out. The cold air kills it. But anyway, enough of that. If I drive it every day or fire them up every two days, it ain't too bad. I got about 40 more screws put in my fence and I'll be done with this 80 foot stretch. I got me some of my knee pads. They're pretty dirty. I've been walking on them. But yeah, let me go get my 40 screws and we'll go out there and put those in real fast. Kind of thinking about going to get in some, uh, I got some smoke on my garage up there. Thinking about going to get me some uh, pickets and stuff to like do my gates. I gotta buy some gates or something. Alrighty then, let's go over here. Set you guys up. My drill's getting very low on power. Oh, we about knocked you over. make an inspection on this fence and if I see where I miss a screw or something I'll turn you guys back on I don't know how I did it but it's on this one on the end here this angle piece I got one missing right there I got two there and then I come over here where is it it comes down through there like that and then there's the never missing one it goes right see the crack got a screw there, but there ain't one over here, there's only one in that board. So, we got a bit of screw in that one. See if we can get that done. Oh, 
bills up. <laughs> All righty. We got to do some dirt work right here still. I'm going to bring that up right there where that, that dirt's low. I'm going to taper that out a little bit more. Kind of turn it around like this. I don't want to cover up that uh, survey marker. But I probably will move that post, put it up here next to my fence or something. But yeah, looking pretty good. There's the inside of it. And there's all the water. And we're expecting more moisture tonight. It's going to suck. That thing's full of water. I'm still going to take some dirt by that bobcat right there. That's a good loader. There's a high spot right in here. I'm going to put it over this way. And level this out a little bit more. This got a bigger, a little bit more of a slant here. So I can mow it. Make it look good. Yeah. All right, that'd be it for right now until I find something else I'm doing. I'm attempting taking these sides off this one ton I got. So I can load my lumber on it easier when I go up to get my rest of my fence. I'm gonna haul it on this one ton. That sucks unloading that trailer, but this would be a little easier. Just reach up there and get it off there. I don't have to bend over. It's these screws here, I don't know how big they are, but they're really stuck in there. But I'm just trying to get it up high enough, then I'll throw a sledgehammer in there. And I'll, if I can get this out of the hole, I'll take a sledgehammer. And uh, then I'll uh, take me a sledgehammer to it. Those front ones and see if I can get them out of there. down somewhere set you on the escaverna so you can see this catastrophe actually I'm about to run my battery dead so I'm gonna get that up high enough where it comes out of the hole then I'll get you back with you in a minute okay we got it up in the air see how it's all up but I decided to uh, pull it out here in the driveway a little bit where I can get my tractor up the side of it my little one I think of going up underneath it now and I'll just lay it back against the bucket so let me get that set up I was filming it I, I didn't film the smacking it with a hammer couldn't get the screws out so I just knocked them off there they're reusable Let's see if I can pick that dumb thing up one here in the front is rotted off. This one's rotted off. I have to replace it. Well, that's a bummer. Alright, we're going to see if we can knock all these screws out of there. Four little screws holding each one of them boards in so that I got the big ones off. We'll put you on here. You might not make it, but We'll see what happens. You might run out of battery.
truck looks totally different without the sides on it. It's like a lumberyard truck now. Well, the first nut came off of it. We'll see about the second. Uh, you guys are going to run out of juice. So we're trying to get these, uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six more of them out. I'm going to get back with you if I get them out. You always got that one damn bolt that I want to come off. Okay, what we got here, I tried pliers, regular old pliers, but now I'm going to put this there pipe wrench on it. See if I can clamp it on that good enough. If this don't work, I'll probably end up cutting it with a with a uh, uh, something. I ain't got enough battery to show you, so I'm gonna turn it off. See if I get. I'll tell you know if I get it or not. Can't believe it's she's gonna come off. We got her. Yay! We'll keep that nut too. <sighs> These two we had troubles with. The other ones are back there. There's a bunch of washers on the ground. Three of them. I don't know if we got them all off or not. Alright, now I gotta get that 2x4 off there. And take it in the shop. Cut me one. That'll fit in one of these stake holes. And drill all my holes in it. And bring it back out here and put it on. Alright, I just had to cut me a 2x4 and I notched it out so it fits in my slots. So it fits in the, uh, see how I notched it? So it'll fit in the uh, stake holes. Now I clamped it together here so I can drill through here. Through each one of these with a paddle bit. And then it should, uh, I got me a paddle bit. I'm going to drill, I clamped it together so they'll be in the same spot. So let me see if I can get that done. Sorry I'm not letting you watch me work, but uh, my battery's about dead. Well, if I didn't get anything else done today, I got, whoa, I got this board put on my truck, which is a good deal. Oh my goodness. I gotta get that wrench out of there real quick. See if I can get it done before you guys go dead. Hold still. Oh, you're not gonna hold still. Alright, I guess that's all it's gonna be. Good enough. Okay, now when I go and get my lumber, they'll be able to set their runners and take their forklifts that are out on my truck. It's going to be way a lot better, easier. It's going to be sweet. The only bad thing about it, my truck's higher in the back than it is in the front quite a bit. But it's going downhill right now too, though. So, if I had to, I guess I could raise the bed. I could raise the bed and level it out if it's too big a problem. But, yeah. Now we got a flatbed to haul some fencing on. I probably, I don't know if I'll ever put those sides back on or not. I'll probably end up taking that headache rack off actually and make it more like a, I'll probably make me some different sides that fold down, that fold up and down like a tailgate kind of, but the whole side will come down, the whole side will fold down so you can load things from the side and shut the, shut the side. So yeah, we'll see about that. All right, I guess that's gonna do it for this one. Ain't a very good video, but whatever. I'm gonna try to stretch that wood. I'll put two pieces in the night, a couple in the morning, a couple around noon, and I'll be about out then. Then I may have to get some more. If it looks like it's gonna be cold longer, I'll have two for later tonight. Two for the morning, a couple of little ones in the morning maybe. Ah shoot, I better go get that little pile of wood I got out there. I got a little pile, I'll just go get it.